So if you guys are looking for some cheap FIFA 20 coins, head over to u7buy.com. You can buy coins off the website. You can also buy players. So if you wanted Messi, you could buy him off the website. Make sure to use code MUZ at checkout for 5% off. Okay, boys, I've just done the National Pride, the England version. You get a 50k pack back from this. I, I had to do loyalty. It's meant to cost like 45k on the uh, footbin, but I only did it for 20k. Luckily, I did have Asper Leclerc. That's a big thing because he was 15k, 15, 16k. Um, I actually had him untradeable. I think I got him in a gold upgrade. It might have been Div Rewards. I can't really remember. But um, the rest of this, yeah, 20k, boys. So not too bad for a 50k pack. I'm fully expecting not a board. Fully expecting not a board. Um, but we'll see. Hopefully we can get something worth 20k or more. Or I'll take a 15k. Here. So here we go, boys. Please do drop a like. We can't. I think Argentina striker. We get a card here, again. <laughs> oh my god! The guy returns again. That's a solid 30k. To be fair, that's the second time I've packed a card. Here. And I've got the Argentina. Ooh! Ooh! Bellerin as well! 15k! That's nearly my uh, most expensive player. An 80 rated Bellerin. He actually was unreal against me. I was in like a really intense game and Bellerin, so good. Um, what about Higuain? Is he like 10? Solid like 9 ish. Cruz. I'm going to keep a lot of these. Cruz for 800. Hilaro Mendes. That's an unreal pack. Matic. Right, okay, boys, we've done the uh, the brand to Dortmund. We get a prime, is it Electrum pack? I think. It only cost me 500 coins. I only had to buy Caballero. The rest was untradeable. Um, I hope we can get something. We didn't get a board from the uh, the Pulisic one. So, if we don't get a board again, this video is getting deleted again. FIFA points. Get that out of my sight. Right, here we go, boys. Prime Electrum players pack. We have six rares. I think this is the pack with silvers, and I might be wrong, though. Go on, just be a board. Be a board, be a board. It is a board. Oh, it's a walkout. Spanish. Centre mid. Oh, it's Tiago. Yo, I'll take a Tiago. Is that tradable as well? I think that's tradable. A Tiago. This kit, by the way, is so nice. Valencia kit. Packed it in the, in a video the other day. I thought, do you know, I'll put it on. Kind of nice. Tiago, though. I think that might be my, my second walkout this FIFA. My first walkout was the Icardi, I think. The one touch Icardi. I don't even know if that one Dr. Cali is a walk -up. Yeah, he will be. And then Tiago, so happy days, boys. Tiago's a nice, nice little pull. No! It's an untradeable Bitzel! No way! I was going to expect another thing. Let's go, man! The best of you in the game! Oh my god, what a pull! In my he's not getting sold all oh, year. He's untradeable. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, so good. Oh, yes. Show me that. Oh, oh, it's a walkout. First walkout from a gold upgrade. Belgian. Centre back. It's going to be a dead walkout, but we will take it. It's going to be Alder Veril. We'll take it. Our first walkout from a gold upgrade. And uh, my padlock is increasing rapidly. It started off horrific. That's another. How is he, like, generally, how is he that happy? And he plays. For f***ing Spurs. Okay, we've got a Bundesliga premium gold pack. We're about to go pack Sancho. Sancho will be nice, please. Sancho and Nabry or uh, Witzel. I'll take like a Witzel. And Alaba. Alaba. In fact, Alaba. Normal Alaba would fit in perfectly with my one to watch Coutinho. So, Alaba. Speak to me. I don't know what rated Alaba is. Is he 85 again? I don't know. 84, 85? I don't know. Not too sure. We've got the black doors, we've got the rare. Have we got a walkout? We do not, but we've got a board. We've got Spanish, that's going to be Javi Martinez. And I'll take an 84 Javi Martinez. Nice for SBCs. I'll take a Martinez. 
Be a nubby behind it, a Sancho. Okay. Oh. Okay, boys. So, Weekend League will have just started when you guys are actually seeing this. This is my current team. I'm not really fully happy with it. So, if you guys could give me some recommendations. I need to swap it up a little bit. Most of it's pretty sick. But Mbabu, after playing with him for how many games? I've played with him 37 games. In, like, mostly Div 4 slash top end of Div 5. Um, he's been a huge issue and I've noticed it's, it's because of his defensive awareness He's not in the right place at the right time a lot of the time and, and Babu's just not great So 9k for him, he's quite good though to be fair, he's quite good, he's fast And he's, he's physical, he's obviously sick but he's always out of position And um, if I'm playing against someone that's really good, that's going to screw me over a lot So I kind of want to swap out and Babu but at the same time there's no good right backs There's hardly any good right backs in this game that are cheap um, especially from Bundesliga anyway, and Babu's like the only good one. Piszczek is too slow, Kimmich is way too slow. Um, so I'm going to have to probably change up this right hand side somehow. And also my striker spot is a bit of an issue at the minute. I'm currently playing Nabri as a left centre mid. My striker's actually Sancho, but Sancho's finishing. His goal to game ratio is actually not too bad actually, 10 goals, 11 games. He feels so nice on the ball, but his finishing isn't the best. I can't lie, but he's, he's not a bad card to be honest. But the only really upgrade at striker for Bundesliga wise is probably, you could say maybe Lewandowski. I've used Lewandowski's loan and he's not too bad. Uh, but Marco Royce looks absolutely sick, but price at like 300k. It's ridiculous. I've got a lot of investments, boys. So if I sold my um, all my investments, I could probably get Royce for weekend league. Just don't know if I want him. I really, is he worth 300k? I don't know if he'll go down as well. So. Um, other than that though, Allen and Witzel, absolutely unreal, Mertens I really like, uh, Militao, Kanji, um, Tellers is absolutely unreal for the price, 6.5k, unreal, 37 games, Neto's been doing decent for me, um, do, did not like Ariola. like I said in the other video, Ariola was horrific, so uh, that's the current team I'm going to go with into Weekend League, I'll change my super subs as well, you got to use your, uh, your loans boys. I will end up using my loans. Balax, okay. I think I've used a f how many games? One game. Well, actually, one game, two goals. Not bad. Um, Hazard and Salah's been. He's sick off the bench. Off the bench, Salah is sick. So uh, that's my current team going to the weekend league, boys. Got 170k spare. And I've currently got these investments. I've got these two that I pack pulled. Icardi, first stone, a tradable. Um, twice, actually. I can't believe I got him twice. He currently going for like 30k and I feel like that's, I don't know, is that a bit underpriced? Maybe I should sell him, um, but I'm just hoping he gets a picks up, uh, even if he gets like a goal, he'll probably go up even like 5k or so, because uh, that's how like Team of the Weeks and stuff work. Anyway, and um, we've got Informs that I've invested in, so we've got um, this for comp for 12k, which is sick price for an 84 rated, and obviously English left back, only 11k, discard price, so you can't really, you can't really lose coins on that, and then a few 84s and 83s and stuff like Literally like a 1.4k, which is mad. So I've just been patient on, on a lot of them stuff. I did have Perisic, and the thing with Perisic, he was sick, and I was playing him at striker. Problem with Perisic is, with this delayed gameplay, if you guys have been playing Rivals, so you guys will know, the delayed gameplay Rivals is it's just unplay it's so boring to play in, and it's unplayable. And players like Perisic are just absolutely horrific in delayed gameplay. So I wanted to get rid of him. Sancho in delayed gameplay is still pretty sick. He still moves very nice. And the skill moves, but I will miss Perisic. But if he has all the responsiveness, I might buy him back because his finishing and stuff was sick. So um, there's Perisic. But anyway, boys, that is my current team. I'm hoping the goal for this year, I'm hoping to get Elite 3. That's the main aim. I, do, I generally don't know if I'm going to even qualify for this weekend. I'm dreading it, but I probably will. And um, auto qualifications now, Gold 3 as well. I was going to maybe play till, gold, uh, till Silver 1 if I hated the gameplay. Uh, but current. Auto qualification is gold three, which I have no idea why they've done that. It's kind of triggering, um, but yeah, I'm hoping first week in league. I want probably minimum gold two, minimum gold two, gold if if I play all my games, gold two, gold one. But the but the main aim for this year is elite. I've never got elite. I've I've been close to elite quite a few times on past Fifas, never got it though. But um, but yeah, I, I'm happy with the team I've currently got. A few changes needed. Um, but yeah, boys, if you could drop a like, that'd be sick. Drop through if you're new. And yeah, boys, I'll catch you in the next one. By the way, boys, let me know what you guys um, get in the weekend as well. But yeah, boys, I'll catch you.